Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to do a little weekly vlog this week just because I have a lot going on this week. I have appointments, I have a haircut. Yes, we're shopping this bad boy off because we need mom hair. And something that's so much quicker to do. But I just wanted to do a little weekly vlog. I have been getting requests on doing more vlogs. So I figured let's just do a weekly one. So I actually just filmed a video. Um, it should be up already by the time this vlog goes up. But it is how to customize your background um on ios 14 if you guys do have an iphone i got so many questions when i had posted on my story like a screenshot of my home screen so i just wanted to make a little quick video on that so i'm going to spend today editing that like literally i just finished like let me show you guys my setup like literally just finished filming i still have iMovie up my ring light's still on I was watching YouTube before. But yeah, that's what I have planned for today. I might film another video if I'm in the mood because honestly, last night I had uh, I had my first Braxton Hicks and it was it was intense. It was insane. I've never felt my stomach like tighten up like that before. And then on top of that, I was having like chest pain and it was it was bad so today i don't want to like over exert myself and go crazy but i did just film that video and technically filming this vlog is filming a video as well so i don't know if i'm gonna film another video because then that's like three videos today and let's not go too crazy now i'm trying to think what else i have to do today i have a whole checklist that i like to set up over the weekend for my week ahead so I know I have to go a little quick grocery shopping today as well just for dinner tonight because I'm going to make a big CD. So I'm going to do that. I might take some pictures for Instagram right now, just like little cute selfies or something. So I think we're going to do that. Um, I definitely have to clean up. I want to start packing my hospital bag because honestly i have like three and a half weeks left until i'm 40 weeks so and you know babies can come whenever they want to so we need to get that packed up over the weekend i got a bunch of stuff from amazon that i needed for my hospital bag so i can now pack it but I might do a what's in my hospital bag video too. I don't know. I feel like I have so many video options. But yeah, I just like have it on the floor over there. Just like a ton of stuff that I need to pack up into a hospital bag. I'm a mess right now. I literally feel like such a hot mess. Like I'm all over the place. But all of little baby's clothes are cleaned. So at least I got that done. I just need to put it away in a drawer, which I need to get little drawers for that too. But all his clothes are hanging up. So let me show you guys that because of that I'm so excited and I, ugh, every time I walk past this closet, it excites me so much. So like, look at this. It's all in order, of course, from newborn down to, I think I have up to like nine months here. I might organize it to like color coordinated for each little month section. But yeah, his little clothes look so cute in the closet. So this is just what I'm wearing today. I just changed from the last clip because I was just filming in that little cropped sweater. And of course it was a cropped sweater. So like half my belly was out and we are not doing that. So I'm literally just doing comfy vibes because that's all that fits me right now. I miss looking cute. I can't wait to look cute again. I'm about to be 37 weeks on Wednesday. So he will be here soon and I can get back into my cute little outfits. But for now, this is what we're doing. It's super fall vibes outside today and I love it. It's like... 60 something degrees honestly that's like perfect for me people love to complain but that is perfect for me so i'm just wearing like a little sweater here from pink some basic leggings and a denim jacket and i'm going to love this weather 
because I think the rest of the week it goes back to being 80 degrees and I'm like no like can we just have fall stay please sweater weather I want to wear hoodies all week and also just taking in my last couple days with my long hair because it's getting chop 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 look at that look at that the length all right shrinkage is real but that is the length all right let's go grocery shopping now happy first day of fall i'm so excited i love this season it's the best season of them all so it's tuesday um i never finished the vlog yesterday but you know what just start fresh on a new day so yesterday i ended up never putting together my hospital bag which today i'm definitely gonna do but yesterday we ended up putting the car seat into my car so i'll put some clips here and by we i mean my boyfriend did it <laughs> because i did not do anything i just sat there and watched but i at least felt accomplished to have like something else done with the baby stuff just like having it in my car ready set to go i have a doctor's appointment today so it'll be nice just that i have everything set and ready what i really need to do right now is these brows because i don't know i've slacked off i used to do my brows like once a week and lately it's just been like whenever so they need to get done because they look a hot mess and every time i do my makeup now i'm like oh my gosh mm -mm. um i think i'm gonna film again i think i'm gonna do like an update on my apartment since it's been a month since we've been living here so i wanted to show some decor pieces and furniture and stuff like where we got everything and just like affordable stuff so all of you out there balling on a budget that video should already be up too by the time this vlog goes up so i'll link that one as well but yeah let's get our day started because um we look at crusty dusty over here so it's been a couple hours now um clearly my brows are done we're looking good now i filmed a video this morning already and now i'm about to eat lunch so i'm gonna show you guys what i'm having because uh, it's one of my favorites so i'm just gonna make these jamaican beef patties but it has to be this brand golden crust is the absolute best i love beef patties so much and i only ever like the mild ones i'm not crazy about the spicy i literally love anything that's like a turnover with meat inside so like an empanada or a beef patty or a wonton like literally anything i love anything that has like dough and meat inside i've never had an authentic beef patty before but this is i feel like is the closest one that i can get so we were actually supposed to be going to jamaica next month but because of this little guy here and corona that just completely killed that whole vacation so i can't get a real beef patty a real jamaican beef patty until we go to jamaica sometime but yeah that's just what i'm going to have chill for a little bit maybe start editing that video that i was working on and then go to the doctors and we'll be back a little later spooky season i'm about to make these yummy cookies my favorite time of year to make these cookies these are literally the best hello guys it is wednesday Ooh, too much light um my hair is looking a mess right now because we are about to go to the hair salon and get this chopped off. So because I do go to a curly hair salon, you have to already go with your hair like detangled and in its natural state, no products in it. So this is my natural hair, no gel. I just washed it last night and let it air dry. And this is what we get. So it is super soft and detangled but this is how it makes it easier for them to cut and get into the perfect shape so uh, i can't wait to have my short hair back i love the long hair but it's just it's so hard to manage and even now like it just feels dry like 
it needs that tender loving care and also i only cut my hair like once a year and the last time i cut it was may of 2019 so it's been like a year and a half since i've cut it so we definitely need to chop all of that off because it's gonna be up to here so it's probably gonna be like that much getting chopped off which is a lot but my hair goes fast i don't have any like attachment to my hair like cut it off it'll grow back fast anyway but also today we are 37 weeks <sighs> it's getting hard it's getting very hard to walk to breathe to do anything actually not so much to breathe i'm just getting out of breath because i feel so heavy but now that he is dropping a bit I do feel relief on my ribs. My ribs don't hurt as much. I can breathe a little better, but oh, there he goes moving. But yeah, we are 37 weeks. We're about to be over. It's about to be done. Baby is about to be finished baking in the oven. And we are back to short hair. It feels so good and so freeing. Literally all of my highlights are now gone <laughs> because I had to cut so much off but i'm so happy with how it looks so we're basically back to my natural hair color but you know what it looks good so hello it is the new me or the old me back again but better you know it's so soft and i love it i love like the after hair salon smell too like mm, i can't stop smelling my hair and you know when you get your hair done how they just massage your head so good like I was in heaven. It felt so good. I needed that. I needed that so bad. But here's the shortness. It's all gone. So it's Friday. It's the end of the week. Um, I didn't vlog yesterday only because I didn't really do anything. I just went to my parents' house just to do some laundry. Edited one of my videos. Uploaded that. Really didn't do much. Um, the other night though, I did start packing my hospital bag finally so i'll insert a clip here um but that's gonna be a whole different video of what i'm packing in my hospital bag what i'm bringing with me i figured i'll just do an entire video on it so i'll just do that but i do want to show you guys i did get some new decor so i went to walmart yesterday and i've been seeing this little pot there for a while and it was only nine dollars so i was like yes we need that and then just to bring some color in here like some fall colors i added all these little fake plants also from walmart and i just think it looks so cute sitting here now so I got that and I finally found black pillows so black pillow over here black pillow over there from Walmart those also were four dollars so if you watched my home decor on a budget video that I had just posted um, you guys would see that I didn't have any black pillows yet and I was still looking around for them but I did find them so I'm happy it looks nice in here now. But as for today, I was going to film a video. I was gonna film a whole video talking about how I chopped my hair, why I did, how to style it, all things like that. But I just like don't have the energy to put a full face of makeup on and sit under those lights and film today. So today's gonna be ending up being a chill day i just want to organize a little bit especially with like the baby stuff put his stuff away put things into drawers find a drawer that i like so definitely need to go to target today or something my energy is just like oh my gosh but this is reality this is the life i have a couple weeks left until he'll be here so i just want to organize everything up now that i have washed his bed sheets i definitely want to put that on the bed today and just be as prepared as i can be so i don't know how much vlogging i'll get in today but i'll definitely update you guys because this has been a long week and i'm proud of myself for vlogging the entire week we made it through. So I just did a quick little Target and Walmart run. I wanted to get these little drawer sets things for all the baby's clothes that I just need to put in drawers. 
They're a good size. I don't need to get anything bigger than this right now. I figured these would be perfect, like these little ones for all these little socks, mittens, hats, like that. And then like the rest of the clothes that I'm not hanging up, I was gonna put it in here. But from Target, like hello, I actually got stuff that I went in for. Like when does that ever happen? So first thing I got was just a little bonnet for my hair to sleep because at the hair salon they told me to start sleeping with a bonnet instead of wrapping my hair up in a scarf like I usually do just so it'll protect my curls a little bit better. So I just picked up this one. It was from Cantu. It says for kids, but you know what? We're gonna wear it anyway. And then I just wanted to be prepared for my hospital bag a little more, so I did bring my own toothpaste and toothbrush that I could just pack up and have that ready to go. So now that I got those bins, I'm definitely gonna spend the rest of the day just organizing and chill out because I'm just, ugh, I'm feeling so heavy today. Like even just walking around those stores, I'm like, oh my gosh, I feel the pressure of him just like pressing down, so. Today's gonna be more of a chill day. I probably said that this morning too. Honestly, I don't remember. Mommy brain just like hits hard when you just forget everything that you said. So everything is nice and organized now in these little drawers here. So I'm just gonna stick this whole like drawer set thing in the closet. And we're good to go and we can move on to the next baby organizing thing. All right, so we have the crib sheets all on. I just put the Dakota on here too, which I'm so excited to use. I cannot wait to have him in here. And I always hear that like baby sleeps so well in these things. So I just threw it in the crib for now. I also put together the diaper genie, so... Hopefully I did it right, but I just stuck that next to the crib as well. So that's what we've done today so far and just setting up more baby stuff so I can fully be organized and feel a little bit more ready. 